What is going on, guys? Wonder Man Boxing. Let's just dive right into it. Canelo Alvarez beats Triple G in the trilogy match. Easy work. Now, I personally had Canelo Alvarez stopping Triple G. It did not happen. He said he was going to look for it. But hey, it is what it is. Triple G is a warrior. He's a very experienced fighter. And he's an A-grade level fighter. And, you know, like I said, it is what it is. But... Canelo Alvarez, I had I had the fight nine rounds to three. I mean, what the hell, man? One of the judges had it 115-113. Like, what kind of scorecard is that? Man, that's crazy. That is crazy. But anyways, I think they were trying to make up for that, that Adelie uh, Bird, right? The one in the first fight where he gave to Canelo. So um, anyways, Canelo Alvarez closes a chapter against Triple G. And I know that a lot of people are with me on this one, but a lot of other people are just going to hate on Canelo Alvarez. They're going to say that this fight was trash. They're going to say that Triple G was 40 years old and that it was, you know, all these negative things. But, but hey, man, you know what? Forget those people. We know what Canelo Alvarez is about. And on top of that, you know, he hurt his hand. And they're saying that he's going to require surgery. That's crazy, and he still beat Triple G. You know, Triple G just waited too much. He looked slow. The first six, seven rounds, he didn't do anything to Canelo Alvarez. And then he picked up on the, like the 9th, 10th round, 11. Then the 12th round, he was just hugging. And you know what I mean? He kind of made it kind of sloppy against Canelo Alvarez. You know, there was headbutts. And then Canelo Alvarez had a cut in one of his eyes. I mean, it's just... Uh, I'm just glad that this is over, man. That Canelo Alvarez just closed a chapter with Triple G. And, um, you know, they hugged it out, right? And what a way for Triple G to retire. You know what I mean? He made a hell of a paycheck. Congratulations to him. But Canelo Alvarez shows why he is the best at 168 pounds. Why he is the undisputed champ. Now, I'm just going to talk about that. Let Canelo Alvarez celebrate his victory. And then we can talk about the future of Canelo Alvarez. And if that fight against David Benavides is going to happen. But I'm not even going to dive into that. Because, you know, Canelo Alvarez just had a great victory. Or we'll see if that rematch with Bevel uh, happens. But... You know, I'm rooting for Suter Ramirez to actually come out on top against Bevel. But anyways, congratulations to Canelo Alvarez. And anybody that loves boxing, that appreciates boxing for what it is, knows who's the true undisputed champ at 168 bounds. And that is Canelo Alvarez. And with that being said, let the haters be haters. I'm out.